Hi, it's George again, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about why we think it's necessary for service providers to have mechanisms in place in their network to measure the real-time service performance. So first of all, service providers are required to deliver uh, to their customers uh, as good a service as they can. So uh, because, of course, when subscribers are experiencing bad quality service, whether it's, whether it's the bad quality voice call or they can't um, you know, watch a YouTube video in a smooth and enjoyable way or they can't access the internet, the first thing that they do is complain to the service providers. So service providers have the pressure to deliver to their customers, otherwise those customers uh, might leave and switch to another service provider. So we think it's very necessary for service providers to be able to provide the best possible service experience to their customers. To solve this problem, uh, Huawei has several uh, technologies that we support to actually measure the real-time service performance. For example, we support a technology called IP4 Performance Monitoring. And with this technology, our routers can actually measure in real time the delay jitter packet loss without inserting any probes in the network. So it's very efficient and it's very effective. And we call this proactive network monitoring because with this mechanism, the vendors and um, the service provider can actually see the entire network performance before users complain. So it is a very proactive and efficient way of performing uh, network and service monitoring. In this video, I talked about how we can measure the real-time network performance. Now, in the next video, I'm gonna talk about how we can map that network performance to the real-time service performance. Stay tuned and thank you.